The games in the Roblox homepage are absolutely trash. But I will show you the best games ever. These are 41 Roblox games to play when bored. Game number one, Zone Rush. In this game, you knock people out of the zone with your bat. There are skins and abilities. You can even practice while you're waiting. The goal is to stay inside the zone and the game is really fun. Game number two, we have War Machines. This is a superhero game in which you fly around and the weapon system is really good. You can even unlock better suits and abilities. You fight people and overall, this game is awesome. Game number three, we have Untitled Boxing, which is a boxing game with many different fighting styles. The game is unique, it has stamina, which makes the fighting difficult. A really addicting and awesome game. Game number four, we have Paragon Zombies, which is a zombie game but quite unique. You can buy new weapons by killing zombies. There are also a bunch of abilities. The graphics are unique. And overall, the game is very enjoyable. Game number five, we have Sentinel, which is like a zombie game, but there are robots attacking you. There are cool stuff like walls and turrets. You can upgrade stuff. This game is really unique and just amazing. Game number six, we have Death Ball. This game is like Blade Ball, but different. If you don't know, you're supposed to avoid the ball by blocking it. The ball speed increases by time. But in Death Ball, you can take 3 hits. And another unique thing about this game is that the ball actually bounces. If you're bored of Blade Ball, you can try this game out. Game number 7, we have Prop Hunt X. In this game, you're either a prop or a hunter. The props are disguised as objects and must hide from the hunters who are trying to kill you. The props win if the timer runs out. The hunters win if all props are killed. I love these types of games and you can check it out. Game number 8, we have Dummy Wars. How it works is these people will mine money here and you can spend the money on either miners or soldiers. A really good game. Game number 9, we have Terramon. This game is a lot like Clash Royale. You have different cards with unique abilities. The goal is to destroy the enemy's base. The game does a great job to be as good as Clash Royale and overall, this game is really fun. Game number 10, we have Goofy Gods, in which a random player is selected to be a god with goofy powers. This game is pretty unique since you can buy new weapons, god skins, and powers. Game number 11, we have Super Market Simulator, which is a mix of tycoon and simulator games, in which you hire people to run your market. This game is pretty cool and I like the concept of hiring people to cash people out and restock your shelves. Game number 12, we have Running from the Internet, in which you jump through these question mark boxes and get a random weapon to throw at these things. Everything about this game is smooth, the movement is so smooth, and jumping around feels really good. Overall, very solid game. Game number 13, we have Residents Massacre. In this game, you have to prepare for the night since bad things happen and you need to survive till 6 a.m. It is like FNAF with a twist. The story is really cool and you can check it out. Game number 14, we have Fighting. In this game, you have multiple hero types and do team-based PvP matches. It's about who gets the most kills by the end of the match. The game looks fantastic, especially for Roblox. Game number 15, we have Color or Die, in which you have to stand by the wall that is your color to not die. To win, you must find all the 13 colors. This game is really unique compared to other games in Roblox. Game number 16, we have Carry Me, which is a two-player RP game. If you have friends, this game is perfect for you. You will need a buddy to progress throughout the game. It is really fun and the obby levels are well designed. Game number 17, we have Flashlight Tag. This is a hide and seek game with a twist. Hiders are gonna hide in the dark areas of the map and try not to be found by the tagger who is using a flashlight. The taggers have a limited amount of battery in the flashlight. If the battery runs out, then you lose the game. This game is super unique and is really fun. Game number 18, we have Basketball Legends. This is a very sweaty basketball game. You can practice and stuff. This game is the best basketball game on Roblox. It's me doing some dunks. But next up we have Game number 19, Heroes Battlegrounds. In this game, you fight each other with such awesome abilities. There are different characters with cool abilities. Overall, great game. Game number 20, we have Boat Ride Into a Battle Life. This game is a really difficult but fun game. You have to drag on the water to travel and you can die really easily. If you're looking for a challenging Roblox game, you can check this out. Game number 21, we have Trolley Game, in which you're given scenarios to make a decision. For example, will you sacrifice yourself for 5 people or let them all die? And the coolest part is you can see everybody's decisions. This game is evil but awesome. Game number 22, we have Fort Blocks. This game is a Fortnite clone and 
The details are just amazing. The lobby, the guns, the map, just so cool. Game number 23, we have Daybreak. In this horror game, a random player is a killer and has to kill all the survivors before they escape. The survivors must complete 8 generators to escape. Make sure to play this with your friends, it's really fun. Game number 24, we have Slippery Slopes, in which you climb your way up to checkpoints while being very slippery. You easily slip and lose progress. If you enjoy challenging games, this game is for you. Game number 25, we have Obby but you are a bird. This game is a lot easier. In this game, you are a literal bird and glide to progress. This game gets difficult the higher you reach. The obby is pretty long so you won't get bored easily. Game number 26, we have Build a Rocket. In this game, you build your own rocket to reach the end of the map. As you can see, you can control the rocket. If you are bored of this game, you can check this game out. Game number 27, we have Kingdom Conquerors. This game is basically Clash of Clans on Roblox. The game does a great job on being as good as Clash of Clans. You build your own village by adding walls, houses, and can even attack other players' villages. Really cool game. Game number 28, we have Area Gunfight, which is an FPS game. You can unlock new weapons, streaks, skins, and the game is perfect. The movement is so smooth. If you're tired of Arsenal or anything, you can check this game out. Game number 29, we have Nexus which is a realistic story game and doesn't even look like Roblox. It has really cool mechanics. You can switch through dimensions to go through walls and stuff. Really cool stuff. This game is crazy. Game number 30, we have Poser. One person is a clone and has to convince the audience that they're the real person. The audience gets to vote who is the Poser. A pretty unique and enjoyable game. Game number 31, we have Possessor. In this game, you try to figure out who the Possessor is. A random player is chosen to be a Possessor who can take over bodies and has to survive till the end. This game is really unique and you can check it out. Game number 32, we have Centora. In this game, players battle and rush to win the match. This game is really well done for Roblox. There are lots of explosions and a ton of players. If you're a fan of war type of games, you should check it out. Game number 33, we have Reflection, which is a horror game in which you start out in a dark mansion looking for clues and keys. The story is that you're asleep and need to wake up from your nightmare. This game is pretty scary and you can check it out. Game number 34, we have Beat the Robloxian. In this game, you beat up Robloxians for money and buy stuff. There are a bunch of bosses, a really fun game to play. Game number 35, we have Boat Empire Tycoon. This is my favorite tycoon game. You can build different boats in this game. So I'm gonna build this boat and see how it turns out. Here's how it turned out. This game is so detailed and just crazy. Game number 36, we have Battle Bricks. This game is a tower defense game in which you send units to fight against enemies. The goal is to destroy the enemy base. This game is a single player game and it's really fun. Game number 37, we have Egg Kevin's House, which is a unique story game and quite scary. In this story, you decide to bully this kid called Kevin and bad things start to happen. As you can see, you can make decisions along the way. If you're looking for a story game, this game is awesome. Game number 38, we have Fruit Game, in which you merge two fruits into a bigger fruit. But you have to make sure not to run out of space. The score makes the game very addictive. The game is just awesome. Game number 39, we have Wave Dash. It is a platformer game which is quite unique. You have an ability to dash and you have to reach higher heights. It gives lots of Mario wipes. Game number 40, we have Voxel Blade. In this game, you make your simple blade stronger. The game's progression is super unique and if you're bored, this game is perfect for you. Game number 41, we have Brick Battler PvP. This game is a shooter game and it's so cool, just look at it. The gameplay is so smooth and it's just awesome. A really good game and you can check it out. This video took me 40 hours to make, so subscribe.